Hello friends, welcome back to Vlogmas. I'm not even sure what day we are on at this point, but I do have a fun, let's call it mini haul today from Abercrombie. I went into Abercrombie looking for jeans because I'm gonna be honest, Walmart, Amazon, I feel like they have been letting me down in the jean department. So I went back to one of my go-to favorites for jeans and that's Abercrombie. So I have some new jean styles to share, sweatshirts, outerwear, but starting off with the sweatshirt that I have on, this is part of Abercrombie's Photo Reel collection. I think this is a very classy looking sweatshirt, which is why I've paired it with this little sweater polo underneath. But what's cool about this sweatshirt is this is a screen printing of London, but this London and England part right here, that's embroidered. This sweatshirt definitely has a traditional fit. It's not oversized. I actually sized one up in this, and you can see it just is that classic sweatshirt look. If you want that oversized trendy look, I would consider sizing way up or picking out a different sweatshirt style. Right now you can get this in London as well as Paris. And I have it on with my new jeans. These are the Abercrombie 90s Relax High Rise Jeans. And what I like about these definitely is this strip of vegan leather that they have. It's super subtle. I think you would notice it a lot more with a crop top or if I had on a bodysuit, but I think it's just a fun nod to that leather trend that we've been seeing. And just what a cool updated pair of jeans. I went looking for these because I saw Abercrombie also did a black and blue denim pair that is very trendy. I'm still thinking about them. Let me know below in the comments if you guys would wear those. But this I feel like is a little more toned down of a version. And I think the leg on these is kind of something in between a straight leg jean, a boot cut jean. I really like them. And I do have these in a regular, I'm 5'2". When I order Abercrombie jeans, if I know I wanna wear it with a heel, I'll go ahead and get a regular. And if you're familiar with Abercrombie jeans, they also have a short and a long. If I know I'm gonna wear something with flats or sneakers, I'll go ahead and get a short, but it's one of my favorite things about Abercrombie jeans. You really can get it right on the length. All right, y'all, I made a quick jean change. So this is actually under the same link as the pair that I just had on. As you can find a pair of jeans you like, I know I'm a 27, I know how things are gonna hit me, regular versus short. I can order them online and I know when they get here that I'm going to love them. So under every jean style is like 20 or 30 different options. This is the light wash version. I love the slit just under the one knee and then it also has a raw hem at the bottom. These are a very stylish jean. And I'm wearing these in a regular so I can have them on with a heel. And I just have on this tight fitted tee from Amazon. It's a looks for less of a skims top, but doesn't it really look like the Abercrombie color palette? And I do have a couple of jackets that I'm gonna throw on. I have a couple of cream colored neutrals to go with my color palette that I have on here. So the first one is this cropped Sherpa jacket. This is adorable. It looks like it's gonna be a little oversized, but definitely a cropped style. You have these oversized pockets here in the front. And then I just got in this little faux fur bomber jacket in this herringbone print. I think this looks so expensive. Comes in a couple of other colors, but let me throw these on. Oh, and the inside of this faux Sherpa is really soft. I picked both of these up in a small, and this definitely has a boxier fit. This is pretty thick, so you could either roll it up or you could leave it open for really doubling down on that slouchy look. Yeah, I think that's how I prefer this. I quite like that. And this has more of a mid-weight, so let me throw on the other one. And I know I'm gonna like this one. It is so soft. This one's also a zip-up style where the last little crop jacket I just had on had snap buttons. Oh my gosh, this is dreamy. This is a great everyday just go-to jacket, but because it is plush, you could maybe dress it up a little bit more, but this is just gonna be the jacket that you want to wear. And I think bomber jackets just have a really flattering silhouette. It hits at a nice length. They're typically on the relaxed side and they just look good on everyone. This one I do think is a little more elevated since it is that soft plush and it has that herringbone pattern. The style does have slit pockets on the outside, but it also, has a pocket on the interior. And while I have on these jeans, I have an oversized sweatshirt I wanna try. Oh my gosh, I love this sweatshirt. So this is from the men's department. I did size up to a large in this. This is your leggings, your cozy sweatshirt, lightly fleece lined, it's not too heavy. This definitely has a vintage look to it. I feel like I could have equally grabbed this out of my grandfather's closet, so I love that. This sweatshirt does say Grand Teton, Wyoming, which fun fact, I have one tattoo 
in this mountain range is what my dad do is of. Under this link is a lot of other geo locations. So I did pick up my mom this one, spoiler alert, part of her Christmas. She's right here, so she now knows. But this one says Great Smoky Mountains, and I also picked her up a large. This just has a really great colorway if you're into neutrals. There's also, if I remember correctly, under this link, some kind of 80s inspired ones. A lot of different fun options if you like that oversized sweatshirt. So I know I'm gonna wear this sweatshirt with my leggings, my flare yoga pants from Amazon, and slippers. So I did pick these up from Abercrombie. These are viral and for good reason. They are so cozy. I did go with the open toe pair, but this does also come in a closed toe version. This comes in whole sizes. I did pick these up in a nine. Oh my gosh, they are so dreamy. I love these. I'm gonna wear these for the remainder of the video. <laughs> I wouldn't leave my house in these. These are a true slipper. These also would make a great gift. All right, I have high hopes for these metallic jeans. I've been seeing these everywhere. They look really fun. I'm curious since the fabric does feel different what they're gonna look like on. Okay, these jeans are doing all the things. I love these. This might be my favorite purchase of the entire video and that's saying a lot. So what I like about these is they, they are a denim. This is a coated sprayed denim. So I got these in a 27 regular so I can wear them with a heel, but this is definitely a style that you could throw on with a sneaker. You could have this on with white, black. I'm wearing it with gray because I'm still trying to make that perfect grout fit. This is a Walmart eyelash sweater, by the way, still in stock. I think this makes such a great low key holiday look. In my opinion, these are the holiday pant. You can dress these up, you can go out in them, or you can have them on when you have people over. I would wear these to game night. I mean, they are that comfortable. They feel like you're in a stretchy pair of jeans. And what's so cool about these is they look like they've been sprayed onto white jeans. So there are these obvious creases in the jeans that is on purpose. I think these look very luxe. I think it's something I could have in my closet forever. Okay, I'm feeling myself way too much in these pants. I have one more sweatshirt to try on. Okay, if you're familiar with Abercrombie's Essential Sunday Crew, this sweatshirt is the exact same fit, the exact same style. It just is part of their ski destination line. So this does come in four different ski destinations. I did go with Park City. I fell in love with Utah when I went last year. So that's why I picked this one up, but they are all so good. I love the updated topography on this. This is an actual patch with embroidery work. It's a very nice quality sweatshirt. I do sometimes get these in my typical size. Sometimes I size one up. So this one I have here is in a medium. It does have a relaxed fit on its own. And this is just the dreamiest sweatshirt. I did get a corduroy jacket to match this lettering here. So let me grab it. Okay, and this is heavy. This is like a, the jacket side of the jacket. It does have snap buttons. It has these oversized pockets in the front. I'm gonna go ahead and throw it on. So I did size one up in this so I could have bum coverage. I wanted to make sure I could wear it with leggings later or even have this on with a sweater, a sweatshirt underneath. So I quite like this. And this has the look of corduroy, but it's not. It is a super soft material. The lining, by the way, is also this really soft fleece. Ooh, I think it does have an inside pocket. Abercrombie is doing the most when it comes to all their pockets, so it also has a side pocket. And the more I'm looking at this, it does have kind of a shirt tail hem, a little bit of that dolphin hem. Actually, it's quite nice design details, but one that I would wear as outerwear. I wouldn't try to button this up and wear it as a top. It's too heavy for that. All right, and I just wanted to throw these on real quick. This is like the light wash pair of jeans that I showed earlier, but instead of the one slit, this one does have the double. These are a brand new style from Abercrombie. I think I actually ordered these the day they dropped, but it's a pretty significant knockout on these knees. The split on this goes pretty much from seam to seam, and it is a frayed detail. The bottom of it isn't frayed though. It's just a regular hem line, but these are a great pair of pants. I just love a good pair of black jeans. They're typically what I grab for more in the winter months. And this is a pair of jeans that you could throw on with a blazer. You could dress it up. I would actually love how that looks with the roughed up detail, but how I'm probably going to wear it the most is just with a sweatshirt or a hoodie. So I do have this one that I picked up from the Sunday essential line. This does match the half zip up and the joggers that I've shared before on my channel. So I do like that about their pieces that you can mix and match them and use them interchangeably. And this just makes for a really easy casual look, but I know I'll wear this zip up on my couch, 
probably in front of my computer while I edit this YouTube video. And let's go ahead and make today's secret emoji be the blue jean emoji. Leave me that below in the comments so I know you stuck it out with me till the very end. If you're interested in any of these styles, they're gonna be linked below in the description box as well as over on the pinned comment. And be sure to check out Abercrombie's website to see if there's any deal going on. Like I said, I would look out for those deals between now and Christmas. Thank y'all so much for hanging out with me today and I will see y'all in the next one.